Hey, what's happening gamers? Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe for more LEGO DC Super Villains. And click that notification bell. Uh, today is episode 6. We're going to be doing all of Sinestro. And uh, having some fun with it. As well as after we complete the Sinestro story, we're going to do some uh, gold brick collecting and try to unlock some characters. It's all good. Uh, but hopefully you guys are having a good one. Uh, mods, we're going to try to push the YouTube short that went up today. Um, to try to add some additional views into the channel, because the channel is not doing well. Um, I don't know what happened, but yeah. We've got a, a heck of a fight uh, going on. But anyway, uh, your first like goes 100 likes. And uh, basically there's a dry spell in the game industry right now. Anything that's not an M-rated game is really not coming out. There's not even really any interesting indie games coming out. Uh, now, at the end of the month, there are two um, big releases that will be hitting uh, the E through T rated, and that is Ninja Turtles and um, Sandland. But until then, uh, yeah, that's not until the 20-something, I believe. Ninja Turtles is around the 22nd or 23rd, and then Sandland should be the 24th or 25th. So, but until then, it's, you know, nothing. <laughs> There's nothing. Because, of course, we can't look at um, the new uh, Stellar Blade and another M-rated game that's dropping uh, on this channel. So we can't do those. So we're kind of at an impasse about, you know, what we can do. Uh, now, in May, there's going to be a lot more E and T-rated games for us to choose from besides the uh, Paper Mario game, which will last for quite a while. Uh, Paper Mario Thousand Year Door will take at least a full month to get through, so we'll have plenty of Mario-related stuff to do then. Um, but some other stuff, it's you know, be a lot better than it was this month. Why did they just run off on their own? Come along, my silent friend. If it's a spaceship we need, I happen to know an aircraft hangar near Smallville where we can find one. Wait, we're going to Smallville? Oh, that's a heck of a journey. Okay, all right. Smallville it is. So there's really no reason for us to hang out in the swamp right now. Uh, unless we want to try to do uh, Parasite on the way out. Because as you can see, we did a lot of stuff here in the swamp area. The swamp area more or less is... I wouldn't say 100%, but... In terms of like where we are in the story, we're pretty good. There's a race that we weren't able to do yet, and there is a, uh, a character on our way out. So we'll go talk to Parasite on the way out. I think that's a, a smart decision. Okay. I'm gonna have to deal with you miss later, Mr. Ant. I don't want ants in my house. We have a scout. We have a pesky scout. Okay. Let's go! I'm gonna go talk to Parasite. Wherever Parasite may be. And wait for it. Woohoo! So basically, Grodd is kind of like Hulk from the Avengers games. Power. I need power. Who's voicing Parasite? It sounded like Mark Hamill. Power. I need power. I left my lucky blanket in my cell when I bust out last week. But I can't get back in there without access to a metahuman. You're gonna help me break in there one way or another, so you might as well stay on my good side. Get out of my way! Uh, what's up with Parasite? I really want to, but the boss said I'm fired if I run away again. Parasite, are we attacking cops? Why? 
I have super strength? Oh wait, I have super strength. I always forget that. I have super strength. Yeet! That's not yeeting. I was actually thought I was gonna yeet that guy, but no. Why do none of you have powers? This is the one time that's actually been useful. <laughs> Ow. Enough of that racket. Maybe I don't want to know. Thank you for the gifted membership, Isaiah. Appreciate it, buddy. Yeet! I mean, is this really part of my quest? I guess so. Just beating up lots of cops. That can't be good. Oof. Yeet! Oh, thank you so much, Isaiah. Bless your heart. Thank you so much. Yoink. Follow the parasite. Follow the parasite we go. Where we stop? I don't know. I thought you'd finally left. Please, don't come back. I'm trying to break in, not out. Oh, I don't like parasites' voices. Yeet! Hello, everyone. Hope you guys are having a great day today. The professor is in. The professor is in and ready to <laughs> cause problems. Ready for villainy. It's time for villainy. <laughs> okay, so I have the gist of what's going on. We're trying to break Parasite back in the jail. That seems to be what's happening. Can I eat this guy off the cliff? Okay, I guess we're done. You happy, Parasite? I can handle myself from here. I'll be in and out before anyone knows it. Uh, okay. If you mention my lucky blanket to anyone, you'll end up like those guards. Lovely. Okay, so we uh, we did the parasite quest. Snakes have been trained for stealth missions or something. Wait, if you brought us all the way back here, does that mean we actually could do the race on the way? Oh my gosh, look at that! There's more things that popped up. Um, that is Copperhead. This is. Um, Vixen. And this is... I don't know who that is. Oh, that's Scarface. Uh, yeah. That's a ventriloquist. Um. Hmm. I, we'll do Copperhead later. Because we'll probably be back to the swamp later. So, um, let's do Vixen on the way out. Sound good? Sounds good. Okay. Uh, Ultra... Or not Ultra Humanite. Why do I want to call you Ultra Humanite? You're not Ultra Humanite. Rod, this way. I'm gonna go say hi to Vixen. For the reasons, right? What kind of fashion shoot takes place in a swamp? Say hello to my little friend. Okay, now. Vixen quest. Bell Rev International Fashion and Prisons Inc. insisted on a photo shoot here in the famous bayous to show off these new threads. But the photographer hasn't even turned up. Can you get some shots of me? I could do it myself, but it'd be a lot faster if I got someone to help me. And I'd be able to leave this gross place a lot quicker. Vixen. So we're gonna take pictures of Vixen. Okay. Hey, I think I saw somewhere almost photogenic. Let's take the first shot there. I have no idea how to use my camera. So this could present a problem. Great. Now what? It's Vixen! She ruined my lucrative poaching venture! You guys just never learn, do you? Well, I, I guess it's another random beat of the quest. I thought we were just supposed to take a picture. Yeah, good job being done with the uh, Apollo Justice Trilogy. Great job, Brandon. Yeah, I agree. Arlene Sorkin was way better than Tara Strong. Agreed, Isaiah. At doing Harley's voice. Agreed. Uh, oh, there's another bad guy. Alright, this looks like it'll work as a backdrop. Photo shoot away! I'm supposed to take your picture? Ow.
Are we taking a photo? Okay. Vixen! Did that not count? I have no idea. We got it really close off. Is it supposed to be a selfie? Vixen literally ran away. If it's supposed to be a selfie. Oh. Is good for something after all. Hi, Jarrell. Hi, Juan. Hi, everyone. Hi, Alpha. Hi, Jade Rose. Hi, Isaiah. We're uh. contractually obligated to include a picture with Bell Rev in the background. Fashionable, huh? Can Hi. you can you do a different pose? Hi, Game Wing. Hi, Delta Ray. Hi, Silver Sonic. Hi, Misty Dolphin. Hi, everyone. Hi, Robbie. Hi, Tim Reed. Hello, everybody. Can we have her do a different pose? Hi, Jade Rose. Hi, JD. Hi, Captain Zach. And hi, Tyrod. Hmm. Does this everyone realize that Shredder's Revenge has now been out for two years, this Tyrod? Yep. Hi, OH. Hi, Sharon. Hi, Jacob Orion. Hi, Rebecca. Hi, uh, Brandon. Hello, Marco and um, the Eyes. Hi, everyone. Let's go for one more shot. Including some of the local wildlife might make our photos more interesting. This is a real photo shoot, huh? Okay. I don't know. I'll ew, tell you ew, later. Ew, ew, I, kind of a, I don't know. I have something on my mind that doesn't really matter. Hmm. Maybe we should try looking for some higher ground. Alright, let's look for some higher ground then. And then, Vixen, we're going to Smallville. Oh, only thing. Well, Lots I know a little bit about Vixen. Makes getting around a little easier. I know she's a model. Don't let her get away, guys! I'm trying to work here. She's a model. She's from Africa. She can use animal spirits. She dated John Stewart at one point. Yep. And yeah, she has a modeling career and she's a superhero at the same time. She's a supermodel and a superhero. Exactly. Yep. And she's an animal activist. Oh, I didn't know that. Like Selena Kyle in the animated series. Oh, interesting. So they have a lot of similarities, Catwoman and Vixen. Kind of. Well, I mean... Except for Catwoman does, doesn't... She's not a model, and Catwoman doesn't have animal powers. Catwoman could be a supermodel, but she's a... You know, this looks a like as good a spot yeah. as any. It's got flora, it's got fauna, it's got me. Let's wrap this up. It's true. Don't you guys have more than one pose? I there was a way to uh, change poses. Wait until she. Yeah, good enough. Quest over. Quest not over? You're kidding. Um. Why is it not over? I don't understand. Um... What am I missing? Uh... Why is it not ending? That's weird. Zelda, don't even. The quest isn't over. Why? the cat. Julie Namor passed away? What? Isn't that the lady who played Cat one Catwoman? She was the first Catwoman. This is the first I've heard of this. I thought she was still alive. Weird. I feel like people are more aware of people passing away after TV was a thing. Yeah. Because it's like before TV, I don't think people would know all these people. Alright, this quest is not ending for some reason. Yeah, because when I was growing up, nobody knew when everyone was passing away. Mm, I don't see her dead yet, unless it made the news today or something. Maybe there was a rumor that she passed away. She just had her 90th birthday, like... She just had an interview a week ago. Yeah, it's okay. It's understandable. I mean... I, 
Yeah. The Eartha Kid is gone. So guys, do you oh, know why really? this quest isn't working? Like, uh, the Vixen one is not ending. I'm supposed to take her picture, but... I'm glad, good for her, I'm glad she's still alive then, says Isaiah. Yeah, she's 90 years old. There are two Catwomen that are still alive, Lee Merriweather and Julie New Newmar. And, uh, of course, um, the actor who played Robin is still around. There's not many of the 60s cast that's left. Hi, Naomi. Great to see you. Both need to be green? What needs to be green? Hi, Naomi. How you doing? Monkey, get out of the way. Both need to be green. Okay. Miss McCabe, I've been looking for you everywhere. Oh, uh, well, looks like we've already taken the shots. Hopefully there's something you can use. These are actually really good. Kind of makes me question why I spent all that money on photography school and fancy cameras. Are, are you okay? Oh, thanks for your help. Well, I guess that's the end of Vixen. All right, we're off to Smallville now. Well, that was weird. So basically, we had to uh, do a bunch of stuff. Okay, uh, do we have anyone that can villain that can fly to Smallville? Spectre, I guess. Okay, so we're going to Smallville. Uh, Miss Naomi, hope you're having a great day today. Uh, good to see you, Naomi. And, uh, hi, H.M. Golbeck. Hi, Sharon. Hi, everyone. Hi, Game Wing. Hi, Isaiah. Hi, everybody. Yeah, I didn't mean to embarrass you or anything, Isaiah. I just like to double check things. Oh, he, uh, he's alright. Okay. I think I don't think he's. All right, let's go. Yeah, I don't even know who Bird Burgess Meredith hey, is. Sorry, I say it. Thanks. Uh, I can tell you. Burgess so, Meredith. Um, Burgess Meredith was the Penguin. Penguin's gone. Riddler's gone. Joker's oh. gone. Catwoman number three is gone. Batman's gone. Oh. Commissioner Gordon, Chief O'Hara, Batgirl. That's all right. Maybe I mean some of the Catwoman actresses are passed away. Like. So Eartha Kid is not around then? Or? Catwoman 3 is gone. Eartha Kid. Yeah. What's that? The second Catwoman, what? Lee Merriweather, is still alive. She's the youngest. I think Lee Mer Merriweather is the youngest. And then Julia Namar was um, the first. Uh, hi, Julia. Hi, um, everyone. Yeah, Julia. Yeah. But the crazy thing is, just like the 60s Batman show, there's not many living members of the animated series left either. Animated series was 30 years ago. There's only, out of the sort of, like the main cast, <clears throat> there's only technically um, four actors left from the main cast, but both Batman and Alfred are gone. Yeah. So they're the principal cast. Robin was technically a secondary character until the adventures of Batman and Robin, because um, Robin was away in college, so of course he wasn't going to show up that much. You're gonna play Sonic 06, George? Yikes. Okay. Best of luck. I'll see you later. Have fun. I hope you enjoy it. Hi, Jacob Langland. Hi, Silver Sonic. Hi, everyone. Hi, Brandon. Yep, waiting for Thousand Year Door. Definitely, Brandon. Thousand Year Door is in May. April is a very slow month. Welcome to Smallville, ladies and gentlemen. The city of Smallville. Sleeping till ten was the best. Actually, we can use that right there. It's making me feel old, Luke. Says Misty. What? The animated series? Uh, that the animated series is so many years old. Well, the reason why we lost so many actors from um, the animated series is they were hiring um, actors with voices of characters. What um, Andrea Romano said. 
So most of the people that they brought in to do voices, they were people who were pretty old to begin with. Like, um, they were in their 40s, 50s, 60s. There were some cast members in their 70s, in the 90s. And there were some people who were young, like, in their late 20s, early 30s. Yeah. But you have to remember, the animated series was 30 years ago. I was, when the animated series came out, I was around 10. So. Yeah. Yeah, I understand what you're saying. So seasoned, like, actors. Makes sense. But a lot of 80s, the weird thing is, there's a lot of 80s actors that are still around. And they're in their 70s and 80s. Um, but most of the animated series alumni are all gone. Most, a lot of the Thundercats cast is still alive. A lot of the Transformers cast, G.I. Joe. These are people in their golden years, like 70s, 80s, and 90s. This Brainiac shrinking I don't know technology what to tell you is amazing. I don't know. I wonder if I could. Hey, what's going on? You're not supposed to be here. But I am here, and I am the Spectre. Want to acquire Brainiac uh, ship. Hi. Want to tell me what you're doing here? Are you not in the mood for small talk? Not in the mood for small talk, Adam. Where'd he go? Oh, there he is. So this is like a mini boss battle. We have to defeat uh, the Adam before we can go into space. Interrupting me while I'm doing science stuff. Ow! I've never been one to shrink from a challenge. Now it actually would have been interesting to have uh, Maybe Brendan Ralph play the Adam here, but he actually plays Shazam in this game. No. Want to tell me what you're doing here? Are you not in the mood for small talk? I think that's Ryan Chow. I don't think that's um, Ray Palmer. Be a tall order. I could be wrong, but I think it's Ryan. Oh, you're watching Tom and Jerry, Brandon. Awesome. Hi, Juan. Hi, um, JS. Hi, J Dog. Hi, everyone. Anyone else want this? No, of course. What is all that? Some tech the Justice League have put into storage. Is it junk? Not in my hands. There's more than one way to get into space. Like this slideways teleporter, for example. Well, come on then. Hmm. Oh, what's the matter, Sea King? Tide gone out? This earth is covered two-thirds in water. If we're to fulfill our promise, I require aid in searching the ocean. Everyone has their sectors to search, Sea King. You frightened of a little hard work? No, but I detest this playing at being a hero. As do we all, <clears throat> but pretending to be this planet's greatest do-gooders allows us to search unhindered and unquestioned. Here, Sea King. You got a little helper for you. <laughs> Whoa. The Watchtower. Someone has been through here and cleaned it out. Let's hope they've left us something to get us to Oa. There's got to be a ship here we can use to reach Oa. I see those Justice League pests using them all the time. Alert. Intruder. Lockdown initiated. Tamper protocol active. Why is it called a sideways teleporter? Um, I don't really remember the reason, to be honest. You go through it sideways instead of up and down, probably. Uh, it's like a door. It's it's like a door, but there's also a character in DC Comics called Sideways that uses teleportation. So it might be based on his superpower. I don't know. Uh, um, the Justice League has lots of ways that they can teleport this. to the um, else try. the Watchtower. <clears throat> Um, which usually, in the animated series, we saw basically something that looked like it was a, um, uh, something out of Star Trek. It was like, you know, but the sideways t a teleporter or sideways teleporters, um, have been used in the comics before. It's a, another way to get onto the watchtower like in an emergency. It uses a different frequency, I believe, than, like, your standard teleportation and mother box and stuff like that. 
Yeah. But I, I don't remember because I'm not a huge Justice League, like, aficionado. Um, I just know about Batman stuff, so I don't tend to pay attention to a lot of things about the Justice League. Anything that doesn't involve Batman, I don't research. Yep, and to answer your question, Captain Zack believes uh, Kevin was about 36 when he did the role of Batman in the animated series. I, well, we're not sure. Well, I mean, 2022 to 1992 would be 30 years, I believe. So, if you... He passed away at 66, then he was probably 36. Maybe. I, I don't know. I'm just taking a guess. I think my dad and Kevin were born the same year. But I, I don't know. Um. Hi, Linky. How you been? Ah, oh, jeez. What? Uh, either that's an ant or a spider. Okay. Let me see before I freak out. It looks like a queen ant. We should probably vacuum that up, or I guess you'll just squish it with a... It's searching for food. Thank you, sweet pea. Well, Amber's like, no scouting back for you. Dead. <laughs> I hate how these creepy crawly things just show up when I'm live streaming, though. It's like I see that black shadowy thing crawling around and immediately I think spider. So at least I'm happy that was an ant. I don't have to regain my composure because I do have arachnophobia. Whoa. I don't like spiders. Thank you, Ambie. Okay, so we're in the watchtower. Use the slideways or sideways teleporter, one or the other. Now, I don't remember how to disable the uh, security cameras. It's been a while. Broad smash! <laughs> so this is actually not a level. This is a, um, a hub world, actually. Like, this is... Um, it's. I don't think the watchtower is quite as big as it was in the LEGO Batman 3 game. So it, it basically just serves as a purpose of like getting the the bad guys to a javelin that they can steal so they can go to Oa. Um, whereas yeah. in Lego Batman 3, the whole purpose of that game is there was massive planets for you to go to and there was really no point to stay on Earth. So all the free roaming took place on other planets. Yeah. Yeah, definitely. That makes sense. Hi, H.M. Goldbeck. Oh, thank you for making me a character in your story. That's very sweet, H.M. Goldbeck. Um, hi, Sammy Bear King. It says, hi, Captain Amber and older, or Grandpa Captain <laughs> Hi, Julia. Hi, OH. Hi, Imperator Penguin. Hi, United Thrive. Hi, Rebecca. Hi, everyone. Uh-oh. Probably wasn't the best thing I could mess with. Oh, uh, it's a teleport to that Error. Error. Security system failure. Update required. Oh, my gosh. Their weapons are going haywire. I think we could. All right, guys, your first like was 100 likes. Let's get those likes up for um, Justice League. I mean, not Justice League. Hi, uh, Princess on me. Hi, Sharon. Hi, Captain Zach. Hi, Richard Taylor. Hi, Hi Halamatoy. Hello, um, everybody. Hi, Leader Gator. Hi, Jacob Langwood. Hello, everyone. Honestly, mm -hmm. if I would make a just an idea of why 80s actors grow older than uh, people from the 90s, is that the 80s was just a happier time to be alive than the 90s. I'm not trying to be rude, but thing, things were a lot simpler back then. I mean, I, I don't no because I mean the 80s actors also worked harder like the animated series alumni cast they were not voice actors like some of them were stage actors some of them were um, you know, some other things but I mean also again 
uh, you hired voice actors in the 80s to play a, a wide range of characters, like lion and Panthro and all these other guys. They played multiple roles in the same show. Yeah. And also, they, they hired these younger guys off the street. When they were searching for characters for the animated series, they wanted a wide range of vocal performances. So most of the cast members were anywhere between the ages of 36 and 70. So, you know, we you had some pretty old... Um, you know, talented actors who were famous in like the 60s and the 50s and the 70s who were voicing, you know, in the animated series and they had never done that before because the voice director was searching for voices with character. She wasn't hiring voice actors. And voice actors, you know, they would play older men and older women and younger people. They would fluctuate their voices. That's what they were used to doing. They would play so many different roles. It wouldn't be uncommon, like the He-Man show, for instance. The guy who played He-Man played more than just He-Man. He played other characters as well as like villains in the show. Skeletor, also the voice actor for Skeletor, played a lot of characters that were both villain and hero alike. The character Man in Arms played multiple characters. The character Tila played just about every female character in the show. There were like two female actors and that was it. Evil Lynn and Tila played pretty much every female character you came across. Yeah, I see what you're saying. So what you're saying is that they were younger. Mm -hmm. People had the younger. Yeah. Attempting reboot. Systems failure. Error. Error. Please contact the nearest tech support staff member. Rerouting power. Main security protocol failure. Hangar security compromised. System reboot needed. The only thing that happened to a lot of 80s and 90s uh, early actors is because they did so many roles, a lot of them, like, in their golden years, started to develop, like, um, uh, voice box-related illnesses. Yeah, it can happen. Mm -hmm. uh, oh, wait, no, this is a box. Okay. Dun, dun, dun. Uh, I can't do... Wait, can I bring in... Oh, I can bring in Livewire, because we're still technically in a free-roam environment. Yeah. Oh, okay. Well, welcome back, Mellow Knight. Thank you for hanging out. Really appreciate that, since I missed watching the streams for so long. Well, welcome back. Make welcome sure back. you, uh... Hit that notification bell so you don't miss anything, and all of April we'll be doing LEGO DC Super Villains. They said they were had to work a lot. Oh, no worries. That's understandable. Yeah, we had to take a shift to live streaming because it was the only way that people can see our content. Uploads don't do well. We would love to do uploads, but we can't. Now, why did they say Livewire could come in here and do what? This was a specific Livewire thing, but... Honestly, why are these things suggested for me on hmm? Facebook? I just watched this one weird video of somebody getting a very weird tattoo, like a painful like tattoo, and then like suddenly after that, all I get is recommended is that. Mm. It's like, I just watched one video of it, like somebody getting a tattoo on their ear or something. Ever since then, that's all I get recommended. Why did they want me to switch to Livewire if I can't use her? I don't understand. Mm, I don't know. Like, there was a prompt for her. Maybe it's, like, later on in the game. Alright, I need to switch back to whoever it was. What? I'm supposed to be the rookie. So I gotta go back to being Professor Four. <laughs> I really wish he had a golf club. Hi Zelda, how you doing, you little troublemaker? So basically, we're here to try to steal a javelin. Which is, of course, the Justice League's means of transportation. Yeah. Because so we have to go to the planet Oa and save Sinestro. Uh, oh, this thing. Oh my gosh. So guys, immediately following the stream, there will be a Star Wars stream tonight. Um, because I'm very close to conquering the galaxy as the Rebels. Oh, Star Wars. Okay. Mm -hmm. And then I have another stream after that tonight, but I don't know what it is yet. 
Um, I'm gonna have to do four streams today. There will also be a topic video tomorrow, meaning I'm gonna be pulling a very long night. Um, I don't know what the topic video is because, again, we're in a game drought, so it's, there's not really a lot of game news. Tomorrow there is a Nintendo Direct. Security I believe it's at 10 in the morning. Error. Error. Database failure. Security reboot failed. failed. Security is, shutdown. Main power restored. Topic. No security active. Oh, I'm sorry. There's a Nintendo Direct tomorrow in the morning. I believe so. Yeah, that's what people kept telling me today. Nintendo Direct, April 17th. Who is headbutting me? Oh, hi! What do you want? Hi, Alex the Ronin. Hi, Halamatawe. Hi, Uncle Howdy. You know, Jacob Langland is saying it's Indie Showcase. It doesn't matter. It's still yeah. Nintendo Direct. United Thrive says, I, am, I love the topics. Thank you, United Thrive. Hi, Alex. How's it going? I put on the like on the Star Wars video. Thank you, Game Wing. You can't be here for the direct tomorrow. Okay, sorry about that, Sharon. You can always watch it yeah. archived. Tell what are you what doing? What do you think of the No Man's Land run in the 90s, Luke says Isaiah. No Man's Land run in the 90s for Batman was interesting. It all revolved around the whole Cataclysm event where Gotham was uh, attacked by an earthquake. Ooh. And then the fallout from it happened. Like, they did that storyline for almost five years. So you had Cataclysm, then you had No Man's Land, and then you had Warzone. Like, all three major storylines uh, branched off from the whole Cataclysm event. Where, you know, Gotham City was on a fault line that uh, went off and it caused all kinds of problems. And, you know, it was kind of cut off from the rest of the world for a while. Greetings, Kiwing. Hello, Amber. Hi, Darkseid. If I remember correctly, Cataclysm was started by uh, Chuck Dixon. I think that was a Batman story he started. And I think he did part of um, No Man's Land as well. But I don't remember. Hi, Tim Reed. Hi, uh, Mellow Knight. Hi, everyone. Um, hello, Alex. Hi, everybody. Hope you guys are doing well. Aha! Our Javelin is not ready to be powered up yet. Gonna take some time to get the javelin off the ground, but we found it. We found mm -hmm. the javelin. So we're gonna have to cut this gold brick out. Yoink. There we go. Mm -hmm. you know, maybe I should have used a color that's easier to see. Using this green lightning is kind of hard to make out. I think that's oh. why everybody makes it red. Thank you for sharing on um, uh, YouTube and Facebook, Tim Reed. That really helps out tremendously. Thank you. <laughs> this button do? Hi JD, hi Game Wing, hi everyone. Well, I, that did something. Your streams caused me to buy the Apollo Trilogy, says Alex. Thank you, Alex. Cool. I will definitely renew my membership for you guys. Thank you, Mellow Knight. That's very oh. sweet of you. We appreciate that. It's very kind of you. Yep, memberships helped out this channel tremendously as a Shadowbane <laughs> channel, so if anybody's able to become a member, it really helps us out a lot. It's just $5 a month, and it keeps the, uh, Channel going. Uh, where is... Okay, so I need... Oh, we have Killer Frost. She can put out fire. She should be able to. Let's see. Is that correct? Yep. She puts out fire. It's like a concentrate, concentrated ice blast. Anytime. Yeah, thanks for... Sharing that, and Game Wing said, I already got a like on the other video. Thank you, Game Wing. That helps out. Yep, thank you, everybody. Uh, thank you guys for the likes and shares. Appreciate that so much. Thank you. Thank you. There's nothing else here. You can hang out here now. Come on up, buddy. Come on up. Well, should I keep pushing the short from earlier, Luke? Yes. Come on, buddy. You can get up here. Oh, okay. Maybe dial it back a little bit. Come on. If you're going to lie down, I need you to lie down, okay? Why are you being a little hesitant? I'm not going to scream again. There was... Oh, I see how it is. Okay, whatever. Fine. Use me to get to her. I'm so glad to be a part of a member of Killing Let's Plays channel and on the live streams. Thank you, Garth. We appreciate you so much. Yeah, appreciate that, Garth. Thank you. So I see. So you use me to climb on Amber. Climb over to Amber. So I get climbed on. And then you just position yourself like that. Okay. And Cat 1 and 2 are both in this room. I'm a James Bond villain now. 
Oh, James What's Bond. Mm -hmm. He has to be totally on your lap to count as it. Oh, Zelda's jealous. Mm -hmm. The question is, will Amber get two cats on either side of her, like I did the other day? She's thinking about it. What's this happening? Whoa, 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 whoa. Yeah, it looks like it. Link, stay. Zelda? Why? So, what? Which which one am I... I'm getting Zelda now? Okay. How can you be purring when, like, literally he just scratched you? Okay, whatever. Alright, guys, both cats are here. <laughs> okay. Link, don't you dare. Zelda will leap off and hurt me. Okay, so we're in the... This is the dock of the, uh, Japlin. Yeah, we remember you, Mellow Knight Guard. I remember your name. Yep, I remember your name. Uh, 708,000. So I'm actually protecting you by petting Link. I think that's a very wise If decision. I stop petting Link, then he'll bite you. He will. He will do that. See, as soon as I stop petting him, he gets a bite. He's like, I'm coming after you. This is my territory. Turn your little head this way. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It would be a good choice for Link and Zelda. I don't know. I, I'm not good at actors. I don't really know any actors. I don't... No idea. I don't really like actors, really, so... I mean, probably an unknown person would be good. I like when they do unknown characters, actually. Uh, Link, please don't. We're, gonna, we're, we're in for a room. We're in for a cat fight. There you go. Bye, Link. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. Leave Zelda alone. So I'm supposed to use my mind powers? Oh, who would be a good choice? Somebody that deserves it. Ugh. Somebody that works hard and trains hard and is going to do well with the character. Mm, I don't know who that would be, though. Oh my gosh. Well, actually, technically there would be multiple actors, though, because, like... Other countries would have to get, like, their own, you know, if yeah. Link and Zelda have speaking roles, then you would have to have, like, other actors in other countries. Oh, be there'd, be, there'd be a Japanese Link, there'd be a Chinese, Korean, uh, there'd be German, Swedish. For listening all the countries. I still think it's fascinating. The same guy in Portugal has been the voice of Batman since 1989. He's played every role of Batman in the country of Portugal. It's the he same guy. Cool he does have a cool voice, and he's actually able to change it a little bit. Like, he even did the, uh, I believe he did the Bale grovel. Or the Bale, like, <laughs> but in Portuguese. Zelda, why are you, what are you doing? Zelda, what did you do? What did she do? Marking me. I don't know though, I don't have proof. It just felt like it was really warm for a second. Alright, I'm gonna be busy sort of because I'm gonna get my own computer and camera and mic because I'm gonna do some of my own recording. Awesome, Mellow Knight. Sounds good. Have fun. Well, I hope you, that goes well for you. I shared on Facebook. Thank you, Jacob Langlet, for sharing. <laughs> Have you guys played Lego City Undercover? We have American Man. A lot. Yeah, we played it a few times. We've done um, Lego City Undercover when it first came out. We were one of the biggest channels to cover it. We have millions of views on those episodes. Then we did in 2017 when Lego uh, re-released the game for Nintendo Switch. We did that. And then for its 10-year anniversary, we did a, a series. So we've, we've done it at least three times. This is our second time going through LEGO DC Super Bowl. The first time was six years ago, and, uh, yeah. Yep, hi, Blaze Survivor. This is hi, Kaelin's Let's Plays. How's it going? Kaelin's Let's Plays level is 323, and Blaze Survivor PlayStation level is 301. K-Wing is ahead of me, says Blaze Survivor. 
All right, thank you, Blaze Survivor. Good to see you. Hope you're having a great day. I don't even know what that means. Good to see you again, Blaze Survivor. Hey, Blaze. Oh. Is there a Kingdom Hearts manga? I, I don't know. I'm not no sure. No idea. Sharon. Anything's possible. Hi, JS. Hi, everyone. I like that death screen. It says dark, dark side. Hi, uh, Princess Emmy. Hi, everyone. Yes. Have I ever read any Final Fantasy manga? I have never read... No. I'll tell you what, Sharon. I've never read any manga in my entire life. Looks like the javelin is ready to fly. Is that it? All right, we're prepped and ready. Yeah, but thank you for asking me, Sharon. You made me feel like special and stuff. But I'm I'm not as interesting as I'm not as interesting as Luke and everyone in the chat. I basically just feed my cats, get up, and then stare at the wall, and then do my job. I I don't do anything interesting like read manga. <laughs> ready we go. I believe the ship is ready to go now. Unless I'm missing something else. Maybe I could get into it or something. That The only comic... Well, I have to start with the first comic that Luke got me, which is the Green Lantern comic book that he got me. So I would have to start with that one and then move on from there. But I need to actually get through the first comic book first. The only comic books I ever had growing up that were in our house were Captain America comics, so that's kind of why I became a Captain America fan, but I don't, yeah. Rolling. That was another witness calling in about the Atom colliding with villains in Kansas, with no justice syndicate around to help him. Time to check up on Mr. Power Ring and his super friends to see just how busy they are. Clarkson told me Power Ring is on the planet Oa, but he didn't say what he was doing. Time to find out. Hello, Operator? Yes, I'd like to place a call to Oa, please. To the Guardians of the Universe. <laughs> Won't a call to a planet that far away rack up a big long distance bill? Don't worry, Jenny. It's a collect call. Like this when we found it, okay? <laughs> Release me! The fearsome Sinestro will not tolerate such treatment. There. We are grateful for your service. However, there is something about you, Green Lantern of Earth huh? 3, that is odd. You are not what you seem. What? I, I got the ring, the green suit, the cool moves. I'm totally the real deal. I was, you know, sort of in the middle of something. So can I go now? One moment. Stay, as we, the guardians of the universe, deliberate on the fate of Sinestro. Ugh, this is going to take forever. <sighs> Any landing you can walk away from. That was terrifying! Uh, and you uh, should know. All right, knock it off. Let's figure out a way to get down. Our mission appears to be off to a rather uninspiring start. I trust you can at least repair our ship. What? Uh, sure we can. Yeah, we may not be super geniuses like you, Grodd, but we do have our uses. Okay, so we are on... Can you guys think of another word um, for rescue? Because Rescue of Sinestro doesn't sound like a very good title. Liberation... Liberation sounds interesting. Um, freedom for Sinestro. Mm. Uh, jailbreak. Sinestro... Prison break. Uh... Mm. 
escape? Mmm, <laughs> no. Escape from... No, Sinestro's not. Not quite. Recovery of Sinestro. Mmm. Recovery of Sinestro is not bad. Take out? No. Are we uh, prison breaking him or what? Yeah, it's a it's a prison break, but I don't want to use something like prison break of Sinestro. Liberation sounds cool. You want like a cool fancy word because Sinestro is like kind of like this you know hoity toity guy. Zelda. Ooh! Acquisition? Hmm. Operation Sinestro. Saving Sinestro. That's too many S's. Kind of like acquisition. Acquisition of Sinestro. Is that how you would use it in a sentence? So the acquisition of Sinestro. Acquisition means you acquire. Something usually you would acquire an object, like the acquisition of a famous pearl. I don't think you would really acquire a, a person. I like the name of it. Okay. It sounds fancy. Whatever. The acquisition of Sinestro. Well, I guess that Sinestro belongs to us now because we're acquiring it. Yes! It's kind of weird. He is a, he's an object. Sinestro says, I am not a prize to be won. You are. <laughs> you are now. And O is spelled O-A, right? I am pretty sure. Yeah, okay. Alright, there we go. So that's the title, The Acquisition of Sinestro. It sounds fancy. What? I like the fancy sounding name. I would have just gone with saving Sinestro. Yeah. It's honestly what I would have gone with. Again, Sinestro is a fancy, fancy individual and he's fancy. I would have written my title as Getting Sinestro Out. Well, that's a terrible title. <laughs> what is this to? I would have written Yeeting Sinestro. Yeeting Sinestro? That's, that's not... <laughs> Zelda, what are you doing? Why are you licking the couch? She's angry at me. She's licking the couch because she's angry at you. That doesn't make any sense. Yes, it does. How does it make sense? She only has her dry crunchy. She's really mad at me. Well, we haven't got paid yet, so... I know. She's gonna have to keep eating the dry ones. She's so angry. Maybe we should have tried a test flight first. It would seem that in addition to getting Sinestro to help us fight our enemies, we also require him to transport us home. Yeah, let's hope he's feeling generous. We'll need to find out where they're keeping him first. Let's go! Zelda, you don't even look like you're sitting on the couch appropriately like that. She's not. She's hit. She's standing. This is her I'm ready to go stance. She's ready to go at a moment's notice. She's watching me, as you can see. She's staring at me. She's waiting. As soon as I even try to get up, she's going to assume, now Amber has some wet food. I could troll her and just go to the, uh, the kitchen to get some of the drink. Yeah, that would be a troll. But, but a she problem. knows that you don't really feed her very much, so... And if she follows me, then what? No, you feed her the dry food, but I usually do the wet food. She, she already has her dry food over there. Maybe she'll think that you're feeding her some wet food. Mm -hmm. I mean, mm -hmm. you could open a tuna can. No, I'm not opening a tuna can. And then can. eat it right in front. No. I only eat tuna with mayonnaise. Oh, I eat it right out of the can. That is... Right what, what out of the can. Are you Aquaman? I eat it right out of the can, Luke. I don't even need a cracker. I eat it with a fork. Coming out of the can. Oh. Why? You just put mayonnaise no, on. No, I you don't. have to put mayonnaise on I just tuna. eat it right out of the can. You barbarian. No. You really are a Viking. Yeah. 
Yeah, I'd say so. Well, I mean, people say the Vikings were related to barbarians. Oh, Linky looks so cute. Nobody else knows. Him. <laughs> right. Oh well. Uh, hey guys, um, let's get those likes up if we haven't already, and uh, all that fun stuff. Uh, I'm looking forward to Star Wars tonight. That's gonna be fun. And then I need to figure out. I'm probably gonna stream something from. Um, because we have two ultimates that want me to do 3DS stuff, so I'm trying to tinker with the 3DS capture card, but I still haven't quite got it yet. I think mm. that it's missing a um, some type of software update that I need, but I don't remember if Travis or Duo helped me last time. Yeah. Because that was before this laptop had an accident that we had the capture card working on it. The laptop got dropped and it stopped working, and then we had to get it repaired. An accident. Mm-hmm. And I had just gotten the capture card working on it like two months prior. So, I don't remember how I did it. It's driving me crazy. Okay. okay, here I am. I'm here in this fun little place. Wait, what is the name of this level? Oa. Okay, wow, that's deep. So, acquisition of Sinestro on Oa. Acquisition on Oa. Acquired. Acquired on Oa. Uh, I've acquired the object you need. I have. I have acquisitioned the object. Mm. What is it? It's Sinestro. Sinestro is the object. Acquiring Sinestro. It's a fancy word. It sounds fancy. <laughs> what? <laughs> How is Gamora? Where is Gamora? Why is Gamora? <laughs> no! Oops. Well, I didn't mean to fall, but I did. Well, that happened. Oh, we can break these. Okay, well, I'm gonna get some stuff. I'm gonna acquire more studs. <laughs> yeah, that's actually the correct term. No, the other term is correct, too. Fine. In the dictionary, what is... Oh, what? Stop that game. I already know what I'm doing. Are you telling me we're going to bust out a dictionary at this point? Well, I mean, most people just use Google, but there was a time where I actually did have a dictionary and a thesaurus on my desk. Especially what? when I used to write Batman lore. Unbelievable. I would look up fancy words to put in my videos. I would never have... No. <laughs> wow, thank you. <laughs> Worst wife ever. <laughs> really? You condescending. A, a dictionary? Really? Because it didn't sound like no. <laughs> I, don't, I don't like you. <laughs> yeah, and also I used a dictionary when I wrote. And a thesaurus! <laughs> Thesauruses are our friends. I haven't used a dictionary. They help in some us time. find a word we can't think of. No, don't you climb on me, Zelda. We already used the word three times. We need another word you, that you sounds similar. What are you doing? What are you doing? But it's different. What are you, you're making biscuits? What's going on? Now where are you going? <laughs> what is your deal? You can't you can't keep doing this. She's gonna be prowling around. Meanwhile, Link's just stretched out and he's like, hey, I'm just so chill right now. Oh, well, uh, Brandon has the little, uh, <laughs> skeletor laughing. Whatever. Savage Amber says, Richard, you were cracking me up, Amber says, Captain Zack. Thank you. Tim Reed has the little skeletor laughing. <laughs> I don't need Google. I need Luke and his Batman lore and all those fancy big words in the fancy big book, says Blue's Cat. Awesome, Blue's Cat. You're breathtaking. I used to mostly use them when I wrote reviews for websites. Great! I think we've been spotted, guys. Also, I didn't like to repeat the same words, so I find other words that were similar in context, and I would Sounds use those. Super you're you're even less intelligent well, the most important thing I wanted to do with my writing was not overly repeat myself. I did not like that. I love repeating myself. Yes, yeah, so you can't help it. Wow. Uh. When you talk, you always talk either in circles or you. 
point. Yeah, I really oh, like oh, to oh, repeat oh, myself oh, so to oh, let it, people understand what I'm saying. I, don't, I think it misses something in translation. And I, I like to repeat myself so people understand oh! what I'm saying. And sometimes I like to repeat myself so that people can understand what I'm saying. Oh my gosh, I'm getting a sense of deja vu <laughs> with you. Please stop. I'm gonna give this person the eat. Revenge of the Yellow Lantern. There you go, Game Wing. Yeah. How would it be revenge? He's in jail. Oh, he could, he could destroy his captors. Ah, that's what I was supposed to do with that. Okay. Ouch. Destruction of Sinestro. Why is Sinestro? Who is Sinestro? Oh. Where is the Nestro? When is the Nestro? <laughs> monkey see, monkey lift. To demonstrate my greatness. Mm. Well, professional journal is power at its finest. Thank you, Blue Cat. Luke needs someone to say something nice after I was being so mean and so It's very kind of you, Blue Cat. That wasn't supposed to happen, this is the right. Oh, I don't know what it was. When is it? Sorry. I like this game, but some of the levels are annoying when you have to go back, to get the rest of the collectibles and stuff, so it's Cameron. Well, I mean, that's the whole point, Cameron, is you, you play through the game, and then you do what's known as free play levels, where you go through and you return with other characters. That's how you add replay value to the game. They don't want you to be able to go through your first time and unlock everything. You have to come back and do it. I think that's how you play. I think that's how you add annoying play level to the game. That's always how they've done LEGO games, so going all the way back to the first... I believe the first LEGO game in the style was LEGO Star Wars 1. And then LEGO Batman came after. <laughs> Yeah, because I, I believe the first LEGO Star Wars game was in 2005, which would be Revenge of the Sith. I think. Yeah. yeah, no, I mean, Luke did most of it in his head. He just, once in a while, he looked up stuff. No, I, I, didn't, I, I didn't know all the fancy words. I had to look them up. Like, I knew some of them because, like, uh, I learned them from cartoons or the animated series or, you know. But for the most part, I, I tried to... Because how they did a lot of the writing style for the animated series was very, like, gangsterish speech. Like, so very 40s and 50s, like, yeah. uh, ways of speaking. Oh, right, so they didn't really always say what they did. And also, my, my grandparents, you know, they, they spoke 40s, so... My, my grandfather was still, yeah. like, when you went to my house, even in the 90s and the 80s, he still spoke like it was the, the 40s and 50s. It was very deep, yep. deep Brooklyn-esque uh, accent. Yep. Yep. Yeah, I mean, Luke did some of the lore on the top of his head. Oh no, I, well, I mean, yeah, a lot of the Batman stuff I remember, but like, how I articulated things, I had to look things. You up. just swapped the words sometimes, like this. if you needed a better word for that. I suppose mm. you can't Part. scare inanimate objects. I mean, it's what every writer, good writer, does. Most writers writing a story or a script usually uh, go over it and make changes. It's completely normal. Yeah. Just it doesn't mean he. It actually means he's a better writer because he oh, makes no. sure he finds the perfect word. Um, Amber, it's one of those puzzles. Have fun. I don't like these puzzles. Puzzles I, I did when I was four from a Cracker Jack puzzle. Well, you're a Cracker Jack, so have at it. Put this theory to the test because I'm getting juice. Oh, great. Well, look at this. Ah! She's ready for ah, it. Ah. Ready for juice. She's like, I'm gonna get some food. 
It's almost getting food. <laughs> it's all those gonna say in cat. Disappointed! She came back to get me. She's like, are we going to the kitchen? She's like, are we getting this wet food or not? Wet food, wet food, what you gonna do? Looks like I'm ready for some wet food. Um, right, they're telling me how to use a teleporter. And crunchies you shall have. All right, so they have a teleporter. I don't, Luke. I'm getting too far in the game. Do you want me to keep going? Want to keep going in the game? I fixed the puzzle. the puzzle and then I have okay, no so idea. Okay, so tell me what happened after you finished the puzzle. I don't know what showed me this weird teleportation thing. I don't know. It just I just ended up right here. I was right here. Okay. When I was done with the puzzle, I was just sitting here. So I have no idea. I think I'm supposed to be Grodd. You're Grodd, yeah. Supposed to move the bridge over on the other side. Okay, I, don't, I don't understand what I'm supposed to do. Oh, I guess you have to use your grod powers. Right, you use grod's uh, psychic abilities, Jean Grey powers. Bitch! Uh, sorry. Bless you, Luke, and bless you, JS. Sorry, you guys both sneezed. JS says, bless me, I sneezed. Bless you, JS. Bless you, Luke. And then we're going to want to use um, Killer Frost. No, 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 Zelda, don't even... Oh, you stupid furball. Stop muting the microphone. Yep, she does it every time. What did you think of the Batman 2000s cartoon, says Isaiah? 2000s cartoon? Are you talking about the Batman? Because there were two 2000s shows, which people forget about. You have the Batman that was 2004 through 2008, and then you have the Batman Brave and the Bold, which was 2008 through 2012, I believe. So both shows started in the 2000s. Also, Batman Begins wrapped up, or not Batman Begins, Batman Beyond uh, wrapped up in the 2000s as well. It started in 1999 and then it wrapped up in like 2003, I think, 2002. What is it, Zelda? I gave you crunchies. Nope, she's lying down. She's lying down, that means she is good. She's not gonna bolt. She's not in her bolt position. She's staring at me. Yeah, she wants food, but Zelda, we haven't gotten paid yet, so there's no food. Electro beam! It still fires out of my rocket! Oh wait, no it doesn't. 
I mean, racket. It needs to fire out of my racket. Princess Emmy says, stop meeting the mic. Excuse me, Princess Zelda, says Princess Emmy. Customizability. Excuse me, Princess. Alright, beam color. Where's, where does this power up come from? Somebody is small. Somebody is gray and white. Somebody is fuzzy. Hey! Hey, why is that not coming out of the racket now? Beam origin. She's so small, Luke. She's super small. Everything has to come out of the racket. Everything must come out of that. Okay. It's like a law. Okay, there we go. Now it should be coming out of my racket. Ha ha! There it is. <laughs> Knock off that racket, Professor Four. Whoops. <laughs> but I didn't even get to do anything. Oh. What is Zelda up to now, says the Ray? Making me sneeze. She is making Luke sneeze. Alright, so you'll have to come back here when a character has uh, explodey powers. The person who played Batman in Batman Brave and the Bold was Diedrich Batter, says the Ray. Yep, the guy from the Drew Barry... Drew... Wait, was it the Drew Barrymore show? What was it called? Drew... The Drew show? Drew Carey. Drew Carey show! That's it, yeah. Not Drew Barrymore, that's it. Actually, Drew Barrymore does have her own show now. She's a talk show host. Yeah, if you want to call it that. Okay. <laughs> she's, a, she's like a Johnny Carson person? No. She is a talk show host, but her show is really interesting. Everything in her show is like... Every guest on her show is like... She's like, oh my gosh. She's like, I feel your heart. I feel for you. I know exactly how you feel. I feel just like you. It's like, I am so glad you were on this show today because I am feeling just like you. You are so important to me. Dial back. That's my impression of Drew Barrymore on her show. Okay. Hmm. My powers of mental persuasion might be of use on that unsuspecting fellow. I'll need to get closer to fully establish a link. Yeah, you meant the 2004 The Batman Show. We have it all on DVD. It's over there. Well, I mean, I'm pointing. You guys can't see, but over where I did the vlog by Amber's Tiger on those, whatever those are, I don't know. The Batman DVDs are over there. There's only three of them. There's Actually, I thought there were five seasons in total, but they there wasn't that many episodes. Wait, you made a bug zapper, says the eyes. I made a bug zapper? That's a racket, says Alex. That's some racket, yeah. I meant the Batman cartoon loop. Yeah, the Batman. Legend of Zelda reference? Seriously? Yep, totally the right. We always have a Zelda reference. Why wouldn't we? Um, yep, we totally... New power. <laughs> oh my gosh. I think, like, Drew Barrymore actually had one of her exes on the show. Either her ex-boyfriend or ex-husband. And she sat there sitting here like for almost an hour saying how much she loved him and she was like, it was super awkward. <laughs> it was awkward. And they broke up? Because she broke up with him and then she put him on his show. <laughs> she loves him, but she brought him on to... And they weren't together. I don't think so. I would I not go on. <laughs> She's an interesting person. I, I'm not a kind of person that could be friends with an ex. In fact, Someone I've never been friends this. with an ex. I don't want the trail to go cold. I have no relationship with an ex. Ah! Wait, how did I get back down here? Oh, oh! I see what happened. Yeah, actually, Drew Barrymore show uh, started during the pandemic. So when she had her guests on, they were like eight or nine feet apart in two different chairs. She's like, we are trying to be as safe as possible. Like, and she would talk to the person if, from if like she was, If she was trying state. to be as safe as possible, I mean, they could have just done it over a video like Space Ghost Coast to Coast. You know, where he interviewed his guests on the teleprompter, or the, known yeah. as the television. 
I don't understand why they just celebrated 30 years of Space Ghost Coast to Coast. It wasn't on for 30 years. It's, I don't understand these anniversaries. <laughs> like, yeah. the, the show... The show was on for maybe, it maybe made 10 years, but I don't even think it made 10 years. I think it only made four years on the air. <laughs> I'm gonna so how can, how can you celebrate 30 years for something if it was only on the air for like, you know, less than a decade? I don't, I don't understand how this works. After I was it's not even on syndication. <laughs> yeah, after I made, yeah. It's not 30 years of the show. <laughs> the show happened 30 years ago, but it doesn't mean it happened for 30 years. Right. Yeah. That's like saying, like, I made a lemonade stand when I was five, and then 30 years after, when I'm 35, I'd be like, I'm celebrating the 30th anniversary of my lemonade stand. It's like, but you don't have a lemonade stand anymore. It's like, but I did have one 30 years ago. It's like, but you only had that for like three weeks, one summer. Make it make sense! 30 years ago, like, there's no... There's no reason to have a 30th anniversary. Like, it made sense to celebrate Batman's 85th anniversary because he's been a comic book character for 85 years. He yeah. still has a new comic every year or every month. So it counts, right? It's a continued legacy. But to say, hey, we're celebrating 30 years of Space Ghost Coast to Coast, it's like, how? It's like when they celebrate 20 years of Toonami, Toonami was off the air for like six years, and then it came back. Wouldn't it start over the whole anniversary thing? Like, <laughs> you would, you'd be starting over again. Zelda! <laughs> I don't know. I don't really know. I don't understand how this works. Yeah, definitely, Sammy says, same, same loop. There's only one woman in my life. That's really awesome, Sammy. I mean, I have nothing against my exes, but like... My priority is to my wife. I, I'm not going to be friends with my exes, and I don't even live in the same state as them. Like, most of them are in Illinois, and, like, there's... There was one in Massachusetts, but she was on the other side of Massachusetts, and there's one in Connecticut. Um, but, I see. Yeah, there's at least two in Illinois. Uh, who I've not seen in almost 20 years. So, what does it be, blue? It's a good no. reason not to move back to Illinois. Okay. <sighs> How does this puzzle work? Step on the stuff. Well, what's the correct order to step on? I don't know. Fish on. Oh. Okay, apparently that was right. Green. That was wrong. Oh, okay, so we okay. have to go with green first. No, it changes every time. Whoopsie. Unless it doesn't change every time. Now it's blue, yellow, blue, yellow green. green, red. Okay, blue. Blue. Yellow. yellow. No! <laughs> that wasn't yellow. I could see that wasn't yellow. Alright. Oh my um, gosh. Green. Green, blue. Wait, no, that's yellow. Green, red. Ye yellow. Yellow the other way! No! What? Why oh, were you yeah. screaming? It's correct! Now where's the green? Oh, sorry. <laughs> it's green. No! Okay. I don't want to do this. Well, I don't want to do this. I don't want to do this look. Please. Pay attention to the colors. You're making me a look on Ladylike. This lady. Too late for that. Green, red. Oh, you walked in the way. Of you walked you in the way. It's your fault you never give me any more hugs because you making me do these Lego games and then I up here on Ladylike and you feel repulsed by me. You get a hug every day. When? When was there a hug? It's on your stupid chart. It says be generous with hugs. You always get a hug. When? When has it happened? It happened this morning. I don't remember it. I forgot as soon as you hugged me. That's not my fault. I fulfilled my hug obligation quota. I don't remember. You should punch a card. Punch the hug card so I remember. Mine, get a hug card. All right, can we pay attention to the colors, please? Because I don't want to be stuck here. This is very simple. Four-year-old could do this. <laughs> You're making me feel sad. Shh. Yellow, red, red blue, blue, green. green. Okay. Yellow. Yellow. Oh. Now where's red? I think red was over by the stairs. That. Okay. <laughs> where's blue? I don't know. Okay. <laughs> there we go. Hooray, we did it. Okay, color puzzle. Uh, you go, Hammer. 
Thank you, Sammy. I appreciate that. I can't believe it took us three minutes. Also, Luke help. doesn't talk to his exes because I have to kill them all. Well, that's dark. Feelings are okay, but dark feelings are not okay. It's called pleading and saving me. No, I don't think that works. Also, you just said it on the air, so that can be used against you. I can end it that word out. <laughs> oh my gosh. Uh -huh. Now what? Oh, thank you, Dark Side. It's very sweet. <sighs> nope, we're being attacked by balding. Hi. Sorry, that looks like the entrance to the prisoner cells. Any ideas how we get past the guards? I'm afraid so. <laughs> I don't get it. What does that mean? I believe Scarecrow intends to use his fear-based toxin to proceed. Ah, uh, yes. That's correct. Ah, okay. I got you now. Sometimes when you're teaming up with other villains, you forget how much wordplay is involved. <laughs> She's a female cat. She has a completely different build than Link does. Completely different In fact, both Shadow, Tink, and Zelda all have similar... Link, are you comfortably being all the way over there in the <laughs> corner? Why is he smashing his face into the... Why are you back there? Are you sad? Why are you sad? Are you being antisocial? Fools don't realize who they're dealing with. He's just being weird. I've never seen him actually go in the corner like that. Who would put yourself in the corner? Only people put themselves in the corner if they misbehave. Did you do something that we're not supposed to be aware of, Link? Yeah, he's angry at you because you touched him. Oh, Grodd has super strength. Of course he does. Why wouldn't Grodd have super strength? He's a gorilla. He's like, get the heck off of me. <laughs> no touchy, is what he says. Wait, what happened to all the Green Lantern guys who were here a minute ago? Look at him. Look at his sad look on his face. He probably wants to pounce on Zelda. That's why he's sad. He's like, I want to I wanna, I wanna pounce Zelda. Like, it's not an option. Beating Zelda up isn't part of your... a normal thing. <laughs> okay, well that was something. Da -da -da, da -da -da. No, it's okay. As long as Luke's exes don't come around here, I'm fine. I don't have that Plus, many. I'm I've already four. claimed... I've already claimed my territory so much. I'm already part of Luke's business. I already know everything about Luke. I'm in Luke. I'm in Luke's dreams. Like you know, I think. I don't dream anymore. I'm in his subconscious. Sometimes she is in my subconscious. Sometimes he'll say like my name at night or something, or something like Amber. Is that you? When I come to the door, so it's like, oh, <clears throat> I've already claimed every every inch of Luke. Yeah. Yeah, I believe so. Alright, so there's some other stuff I can get back there. Oops. Whoa. Zelda, why? If you jump on that laptop, you are grounded, Missy. You are grounded. Do not even think about jumping on the laptop. <clears throat> Plus, when Luke gets really high, like, uh, heartbeat, I can calm him down. <laughs> You you phrase that so when Luke gets really high, it's like high heartbeat. Elevated high. heartbeat sounds better instead of when Luke gets high. Thank you. When he gets high. I mean, with all the high. stress of YouTube, I. You know. <laughs> when he gets a high heart rate. I have elevated heart rate. Elevated. Let's go scare these fools. <clears throat> Wait, what's this? Oh, that's the air conditioner. Mwahahahaha. <laughs> Gonna make these Green Lantern guys freak out. Ah! 
Yes! Let the fear you. Embrace it! <laughs> I like his laugh. It's funny. That's the uh, scarecrow from the you really second animated series. Gimmick, scarecrow. Second scarecrow. Why, thank you, Grodd. I like to think that the little details make all <laughs> they the They do. They do make all the difference, Scarecrow. Great well, I mean, the Green Lanterns, their greatest enemy is they're not allowed to fear, so Scarecrow is a really good, you know, dude to mess with them. Oh, yeah, definitely. Because they're supposed to have the power of will, so they're supposed to overcome their fears. Oh. So if they can't, then Scarecrow, it's like, you know, open season. Uh. We're gonna go save Sinestro now, probably. Save Spear Gas Scallywags. That's right, Dark Side. <clears throat> Luke opens a. What? <laughs> I mean, honestly, I feel like it would make uh, YouTube more bearable, but it's. No. I meant to say high heart rate, elevated heart rate. So speaking of something funny, I finally got around to editing that Mary Jane Unstoppable uh, short. I did it this morning, so it'll be up at 11.30 tonight. It's actually pretty funny. Cool. Yes. Well, think about it. If anybody... Oh, there he is. Sinestro, in exchange for your freedom, Lex Luthor seeks your aid on Earth. I owe Lex a debt. So be it. Let all Earth fear me. Going somewhere, Sinestro? Uh, our newest member is going to show us all how he beat you the huh? first time. Well, aren't you? Huh? Me? Uh, last time. Um. Okay, I'll see what I can do. Your will is weak. You will lose this time. I... I can't do this. You guys handle them. Go! Go! Link has such a sad face right now. <laughs> Link, I never said you couldn't be over here. So, we get this over with and everything's done, right? Link, you will okay, be over bad guys. here. Alright, so we're totally fighting Power gone. Ring. Power Ring is, of course, the evil right? Green Lantern. <laughs> A different Earth. Who is he just talking? Yeah, definitely. His lantern. Uh, so that's one of his I believe his will is so weak. Oh, the second voice of Scarecrow? Completely guide his actions. Who is Fear Guy? Oh, yeah, that's right. I would like to call him Fear Guy. I forgot. It's <laughs> my favorite voice for Fear Guy. That's right, Game Wing. Yes! Game Wing doesn't mind. When was YouTube bearable? Um, for us, 2000. Oh, 2010. It was always kind of crazy, but we were averaging for almost a decade like six million views a month. Like even even on our worst day, like we were still earning income from our like viral videos. <laughs> you sound like you sound like the guy from Groundhog Day. That was a pretty good day. <laughs> Why couldn't I have that day over and over again? <laughs> well, there's one particular day I wanted to. <laughs> but I'm not going to say it. It involves you. You don't need to worry. Ah, I got shrunk somehow. Well, I, I like to think if, if any of Luke exes ever did come back and he was hypnotized by them and he got back together with them, they'd have to sit here and listen to 13,000 videos of Luke and myself on the YouTube yeah, well, <clears throat> Oh wow. The only way for our voices to go away is if the internet disappears. We have too much content. We can never be fully erased on the internet. <laughs> Very few people have like 16,000 videos. 
the person who actually beat us with the most videos on YouTube literally uploads the same video every day oh, and just really? changes the colors in Why order do to they do that? so they can have that stupid Guinness of world record of like 20,000 videos on YouTube. <coughs> oh wow, we have 16,000 and they upload the same video every day. Um Either we have 14, or I don't remember. Like, we can't even access all our videos. It's really hard. You'd have to know the name of every single video because it's not in the search engine. But no, I'm just saying on a, on a, on my worst day. Back when we like, if let's say I struggled on the um, the the O1 channel to to have a video do really well, I always had this second channel to fall back on, no matter what happened, right? Yeah. And that's not really the case anymore because, like, things just are very bad. Yeah. Yeah. It's frustrating. <clears throat> the ice says, I would rather relive Thanksgiving or Christmas over and over again, says the ice. That would not be my choice. Amber's not a big fan of Christmas. I'm not a big fan of holidays. I'm Mr. Scrooge. Holidays kind of. Well, a, a day that I would live over and over again is a day that I could just sit in my room and just relax and do nothing. <laughs> I would live that day over and over again. Ouch. <laughs> I shall deal with this faster than any green lantern. Get him, Sinestro. Give me more studs. Outstanding work, Sinestro. I guess this means it's time to surrender then. What? You want to keep fighting? Oh boy. Yes, I want to keep fighting. <laughs> Watch an EMP wave take down like our internet, and everyone's like, "That's okay, we can rebuild." And like, we're like, "No, <laughs> the internet, the legacy is gone." <laughs> like, everyone else rebuilt after the EMP wave took down the. The internet, but one couple had a nervous breakdown. <laughs> they continue to talk to themselves in a room for the rest of their life. I mean, I have, I have at least like six thousand of our videos on uh, on portable hard drives. We just don't have all our content. Hello, Blackwing. Hi, uh, Garrett. I don't think we're getting super villain status on this level. Hi, the eyes. I just. <clears throat> Sammy says, oh wow, the Kimlings actually will live on forever. They're, they'll be immortal. Maybe, I don't know. Maybe Sammy Bear King. Maybe like 10 years after we die, people will discover oh, us. Oh, oh, oh. Really, uh, yeah, but if we don't have kids, annoying. we don't have anybody yeah. who really benefit from the heaven. <laughs> <laughs> Annoyingness! That's gonna suck. <laughs> <clears throat> this is like Bob Ross got famous after he The thing is, if those people would actually honor what they said about bringing us on a podcast, I mean, we would definitely... Yeah, I don't know what's going on. I don't even care. I, I feel like I'm always, like, cursed with this. Like I've, I've had I've had so many people offer, like... <clears throat> When, yeah. when we were getting heavily DDoS, there were people who said they were going to interview us and stuff like that. And then they just kind of like, there was another big distraction on YouTube, so they like, eh, didn't even really need to talk to us about it anymore because there was another big thing. It's like, um, <coughs> yeah, what made us replay this game, Blackwing? Um, we were doing a lot of shorts from this game now. Game Drought! We decided to play it again because there's not a lot of games. But also, yeah, I would say the YouTube shorts that we've been doing of this is probably part of the reason why we decided to do it. We also gave people an option of, uh, I believe there was an X-Men game on the poll, there was this, uh, there was, um, that unicorn game on Nintendo Switch, which came out in March, really and, me, uh, well, I don't remember what the other, there were four games we had on the poll. Maybe the other one was Tomb Raider, I don't remember. Wrong. But this game won, this game got like 1,400 votes, so... I appreciate the likes. Um, oh, we managed to get superhero, or it's super like a status. palette cleanser on other DC games. Maybe Imperator Penguin. Nothing can stop the power of fear. <sighs> Nothing stops the power of fear. Indeed! I think you and I are going to get along quite nicely, Sinestro. Oh yeah, so in this game, 
Um, Scarecrow is a huge fanboy of Sinestro. Like, he, he's like, he has posters of him and he follows him on social media. All this stuff. It's like his biggest inspiration for fear. Back to Earth. Luther is waiting. Hmm. There we go. Oh, it says, oh, no, was the name of the level. Okay. 130. Oh, yeah, I'm, I'm doing pretty good, um, Garrett. I hope you're doing well, too. Thank you so much for asking. Great to see you, Garrett, and everyone. Hope you guys are all doing well. Mm, yep, glad you like the, um, Lego shorts, Blackwing. That's really nice. I'm glad you've, like, uh, been watching those. That's very awesome. I'm glad you, those are, uh, good memories. <clears throat> My solar eclipse freak out. Jessica, did I have one of those? Amber, when don't you have a freak out of something well, to do with... at least I didn't sell my house or something. A lot of people did some weird stuff over the eclipse. Mm-hmm. Like, they were convinced, like, some there was somebody on the 6 o'clock news and it said, this person was convinced by social media that the world was going to end on the eclipse, so she... I'm not going to continue what she did. <laughs> She didn't do anything dangerous, did she? Yes. Oh, no. I don't want to talk about it. It's like, I don't, I don't want to die. I don't, you don't want to know. I don't want to know. It just, yeah. There was like this weird thing going on. Like, there was a person online that was like, everyone, you need to sell your belongings. They're like, because, you know, the world's going to end on the eclipse. And they're like, you should sell everything you have. <laughs> I was like... After I saw that, like, all these people in the chat, they're like, yes, that we don't need this mortal coil anymore. Like, all these people were writing, like, stuff, like, everyone was in on it. And I was like, huh. And then I talked to Luke. I was like, Luke, do you think the world's going to end on the eclipse? Because, like, I slept through it. So. I was like, some people said it's going to end. Can I, um, can I continue the story? <laughs> yeah. Thank you. Yeah, you can. <laughs> So much ocean. <laughs> Why am I receiving reports of your team allowing villains to escape? Power ring ran into some difficulty. Nothing to worry about. Our master demands results. He is growing impatient. We're close to finding the artifact, rest assured. Being heroes, we have access to every restricted lab and base on the planet. We can just walk right in. I never had an Aquaman pegged for a golfer. Get it done, and don't risk destroying it. Fear not, ne'er-do-wells of Earth. I will carry you to victory. <laughs> Get a load of this guy. Welcome, Sinestro. It's true you will be a valuable addition to our growing forces. We'll need more than just fear, Lex. Grodd is right, Sinestro. Even with our combined intellect, we need some more big hitters. The Gotham Museum has artifacts from Kandak on display. Kandak? You're not seriously thinking about recruiting Black Adam, are you? The key to Black Adam's freedom lies somewhere in that exhibition. A magic prison of some kind. Magic? Oh, Holly and me love magic. Can we go, Lex? Can we, can we, can we? <laughs> Are you ready to leave for the museum? So sorry to disappoint you, my fear-focused friend, but I've got to go catch up with an old pal of mine. But I'm sure Harley here would be happy to show you the way. What? Oh, uh, excellent.
definitely puddin'. If there's one thing I love to do, it's taking weird color-obsessed aliens on trips to the museum. Indeed. But let's hurry. The sooner we can get to Adam, the sooner we can be rid of these false heroes. Okay. So we have um, some bricks, or not bricks. Yeah, we do have. We have some stuff left to do in the swamp, so we're going to do that. And then, uh, I don't really want to go to Gotham. We always do Gotham. I'd actually like to go either into Metropolis today, or maybe even to Smallville. And do some of the stuff here in Smallville. So, because I believe we can fast travel right to it. Oh no, we have to activate it first. Poor Link, he feels left out. He looks really sad. That's because Zelda is only here because she wants something. Mm. She doesn't actually care about me. She cares about food. Hmm. <laughs> and Link actually snuggles with us because he wants to. Link's love is genuine. Zelda's love is fake. That's not true. Yes, it is. Look at her. She's just waiting. It's a means to an end. She's waiting. Once we feed her, she'd be gone. Zelda snuggles all the time. After she She is. never snuggles with me. You're not up all hours of the night. Look, I'm up right now. She's staring at me waiting for food. This is how she always lies down. She doesn't care about me. She no. sits she sits between. Zelda's not a Link is a um, cat that enjoys snuggling. Zelda likes her independence. Why is Link feeling so left down? I don't know why he's acting that way. It kind of makes me feel bummed. Like, why are you just sitting over there by yourself on that other couch? Feels like he's one of those people that are... When you're sitting alone at the lunch table and everyone else has someone to sit with and you don't have anyone. I feel sad about this. It's as if these sneaky snakes have been trained for stealth missions or something. Hey, you. I could use some assistance. I need you to round up some exotic snakes from this swamp so that I can extract their deadly venom. In exchange, I will reward you handsomely. Turn over every stone. Search every corner. Peek under every cardboard box. Okay, so they made Copperhead sound British. I like when he has, like, a mobster accent. Mm. So, for Copperhead, we need to uh, go on a scavenger hunt. She's just staring at me. She just stares at you. Luke, that's just her thing. Look, at she's literally staring at me. She will stare at me for an hour. Oh, she has her claw out. Luke, she's, that's for me. There you go. She's like, I needed that claw. It was to stab Amber until she gave me some food. You really need to do something about your claws, though. Links is the danger. Thank you for the gifted membership, Isaiah. That helps out tremendously. Thank you very much. Okay, so if I were uh, Copperhead stuff, where would I be? That's the question that we're asking ourselves. <clears throat> uh, copperhead stuff, Copperhead stuff. Where's the stuff for Copperhead? Hey, you! Is this it? Let me a hand here, will you? Thank you, Isaiah. I really appreciate that so much. Thank you. Wait, are there snakes in the ground that he wants? Oh! Wait, come back. No, 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 no. We need that snake. Oh, it counted? Oh, okay. So we're looking for snakes. In the swamp. No. I'm searching for snakes. See if you can find a king cobra, the world's largest venomous snake. Oh, we already found one of the snakes. So we need to find two red snakes. Uh, huh. There you go. Red snake now. Coral snake. Its venom is a very potent neurotoxin. <laughs> okay, Copperhead seems to be happy. So, two snakes found. Two more to go. How far are these snakes? Uh, huh. So, we have 
two red and green snakes, so where's the other red and green snakes? Maybe I need to be uh, Batman. Harley, can you do detective vision? No. Alright, so then let's bring him. These guys. Okay, so these fools are here. Everybody keep an eye out and uh, let me know if you see any uh, any snakes pop up. I'm using my detective vision to try to find uh, these snakes. Okay, apparently we went too far because we're playing the you need to beat up people song. That's a crocodile. This might be the other snake. Yep. Okay. Now we just need the green snake. That snake was surprisingly nice to you. For being yeah, surprising. Be careful not to get bitten. <laughs> okay, so then where's the other snake? Looking for the red snake now. Oh, Linky! So cute. You are adorable, you little furball. Why are you so cute? Right, that was Sinestro. I don't care about that. Are you trying to you get some pets over there? Are you trying to get people to pet you? Is that what you're trying to do? Linky. Oh, apparently if you break mailboxes, it's a federal crime. So, uh, I just committed a crime. Somebody enticed Amber to get pets. He attacked you? Wow, Linky. Where's the last snake? Hmm. Oh, I went uh, too far! Blackwing is saying use the mini-map if you can to help you. Mini-map? I guess you're meaning the radar thing, but... I I'm went too very, far! I'm not very good at seeing that. Hey, you! I could use some assistance! Cute cat cuddles, yeah. I need you to round up some exotic snakes from this swamp. Turn over every stove. Search every corner. Peek under every cardboard box. Oh, there you go. Brandon says Zelda. You never call me Luke. Hey. Cute Luke. Hey, you. Yes, I do. <laughs> Zelda's like, when is the last time you said I was cute? All the time, looks like. I do. Zelda's like, what about now? Am I cute now? Oh. What? She's causing mischief. She's over there being cute by your arm. Oh. You're very cute, Zelda. I feel good. I <laughs> Tomorrow will be 100 days of Olympics in Paris. Awesome. Very cool one. Interesting. Yeah, the minimap is kind of small. It's kind of hard for Luke to read easily. Definitely Garrett. Yeah, Luke kind of has uh, difficulty reading stuff with his eyes. And honestly, I remember playing one of these Lego games without my glasses one time and I was like, oh, this is why it's hard for Luke because it's hard to see, see the map. Sometimes I wonder if some of the stuff isn't really Luke bad at reading maps. It's just hey, literally Luke hey can't you. see the actual map. You, <laughs> no, I'm just saying. I didn't mean to be a jerk. <laughs> no, I, I was trying to say it in a nice, compassionate way, but and I yet. <laughs> but I ended up laughing on it. <laughs> you have a disability. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. I don't think you are. I am sorry. 
No, I meant it's Bye. funny because it's so hard for you and you struggle so much. Mm. Actually, that came out wrong as well. Yeah, that also. I meant, you know what, I'm digging myself into a grave. No, keep digging, Amber. Keep I digging. meant it was funny because I realized that it wasn't your fault because it's because you can't see very well. So I was laughing at myself because I couldn't see either. I couldn't do it either without seeing. Is there any way to have the detective vision on for longer? Like, these, like, little bursts of detective stuff is not really easy to see. Like, if you could just switch on the detective mode instead of having to keep pulsating like this, it'd be a lot easier. Yeah. Yeah, it's like detective mode. It's like more like for one second. It's more like sonar than it you is get detective one mode. One second of detective mode. It's like echolocation, like you, you know, like bat, he's a bat. bat sonar. Say hello to my little friend. I went too far. We need to go over here. Is there any way to put like a little thingy on it? Zelda, what do you want? So, uh, just an update for you guys. Um, Ace Attorney needs 200 views for tomorrow, so you guys did manage to get 100 views um, in addition. So, Ace needs... Ace should be at 800 views now. Ace Attorney is at 810 views. Uh, so. it's, yeah, we were playing another game where the map was really hey, tiny. Let me and, um, here, I didn't have my glasses, and that day I couldn't see the map at all, so I finally realized what it feels like to be Luke for a day. I had three monster leeches that I was planning to release around Gotham. It's not that I couldn't read the map, it's that I couldn't see the map. So that's what I think a lot of the thing is going on. If they would just let you, like, I would, I would love to put something over here. I don't want to fast travel to the Hall of Doom because then I'll miss the snake. <laughs> You seem so serious about getting this. It's like you're Batman instead of instead of solving important crimes. You're literally here collecting plastic snakes. I need to get the plastic snake. It's I'd important. like to hear it in like a Batman voice. It's like I can't go out the door yet. I gotta get the next snake. I need to use exolocation to find snakes <laughs> for the side quest. It's important! Batman, I think there's a crime commencing across town. The only crime is this level design. <laughs> Battery. Oh, you let that monster escape. No, I'm sure it's fine. Oh. Hopefully he doesn't bite up some kid's foot. Not my problems. Batarang on the bench. Alright, so we used. That <laughs> looks like something. I don't think I'm allowed to say what that looks like. Looks like something in like a Chernobyl the documentary. Claw. The claw knows all. Alright, so we need to go toward the beam of light. Beam of light helps me know where I'm going. Ow! You jerk! I'm looking for something! If you ruin this snake quest for me, I swear. You have more than broken bones to worry about. What else could they worry about? Broken teeth. Oh. Hey! Hey you! Let me a hand here, will you? It's not fun eating all your meals through a straw. Oh, I had my... Unless it's a slushy. <laughs> I have the story that my... My family told about one of their friends that ended up like... Having to eat their meals through a straw for like... A couple months for something. I don't know what happened to them. But basically what they would do is they would actually cook themselves a, a steak and then they would blend it and then they would eat it. I have no idea where you're going. They blended this, the steak after cooking it. Blended and then, the steak? And then they drank the steak. That would be gross. That would be the most gross thing ever. 
right, so where's the rest of this? Where's this? Oh, I see it. I see it. I found 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 it. It's this way. See it? It's, it's past this crocodile. Over by these stairs. You can barely see it, but it's over here. See? Yeah. There it is. Snake quest done. Final plastic stay. I oh. found them all. I win. Collect them all. You collected prizes from a Cracker Jack box. Congratulations. So I can't tell if somebody modded this game or what, but um, I swear I saw the reverse flash from the CW show, but in this you only have the, uh, the Zoom character from the CW show. Hi. Of all your snakes, now what? You happy? You happy? Oh, thank you. These beautiful babies will look great in my snake enclosure. Yeah, mm, of course I meant to say. In my secret serpent lair. Aha! Copperhead unlocked, finally. Alright, next quest. Hello. Uh, that gives a new meaning to steak and chicken versus carrot. Yeah. Not what Lego game made my head hurt was Lego Super Marvel Super Heroes 2. Oh wow, Blackwing. Reverse Flash from CW is a mod. I had three monster leeches and I was planning to uh. release around Gotham. But the boss said my plan was boring. The boss won't let me keep them now, so I gotta let them go. But I can't do it. Oh, would you do it for me? Goodbye, Jenna. Be free, little one. Go, Jimmy. You are always my favorite. Oh, wow. No, Jerry. Don't hurt him. <laughs> Thank you. You might as well have this. There we go. Gold brick. Mm. Wait, where is the gold brick? Garrett says it's okay. A friend of mine lost her leg to cancer several years ago. Then I broke my ankle last week, and I suddenly realized what life is like with only one leg. So I told her that, and she just laughed and said she's glad I don't have to live with one, only one leg permanently. Oh yeah, yeah. It's interesting when you when when it's like something happens to you, and you realize, oh my gosh, this other person has to live like this every day. Yeah. That's why you have to count your blessings. Gold brick awarded. Nice job. No, go away. We don't want to do that. Stop. 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 Oh, Lego. I forgot Lego Super Mar or Marvel Super Heroes 2 Blackwing. I think that was one of the best, the better games. Lego Marvel Super Heroes? It was okay. I still prefer the Lego Batman games. But that's me. Okay, so that does it for the swamp. Uh, we just have this person here who is... Our face and uh, something's up here. We should probably see what this is. Oh wait, we need to be Superman. So we're playing as um, this is Henry Cavill. This is Cavill Superman, who looks very villainous. I feel so bad for Cavill. He played a good Superman, but it was such a dark Superman. <laughs> and now everybody's gonna get like this new Superman. David Corn Sweat or whatever is probably going to be like Mr. Rogers Superman. They're going to try so. You know what's going to happen? I have a feeling that this David Corn Sweat guy is going to have the same problem that happened to Brandon Ralph. He's going to try to channel too much Christopher Reeves, and it's not going to work for this day and age. That's my worry. Is it's going to be too much like. Here's Katana. I have been waiting for you. And now, you're all mine. Impressive for you. Okay. He's literally playing a character called Clark Kent who lives on a farm, and his name is David Corn Sweat. I don't even know what. I mean, did he actually change his stage name to match the character? I think Cavill's a great actor, but he was given a bad, a bad Superman role. He had to do what was on the he script. He had to be. He had to be super dark Superman. <laughs> Had to put that tree through the guy's semi truck. Honestly, that did feel satisfying. 
Sorry, Katana. But this Superman is gonna wreck you. I am not a new Without kryptonite, you can't hurt me because I am Superman. Wait, why is my eye lasers... I was gonna say, there we go. Um, why is she not getting hurt from my lasers? Okay, whatever. You can't hurt Superman. I'm just standing here. She can't hurt me at all. I like, I'm super invincible. I'm folding my arms and she's beating me up. That is funny. I love that attention to detail. It's like, if you're playing as Superman and they're not using kryptonite things, they can't hurt you. Bye, Katana. Hot take, but you like Superman Returns better? Superman Returns wasn't a bad movie. The problem with it is he fought a giant kryptonite island. There was some really great cinematography in Superman Returns. There really was. The problem with it... There's just some dumb aspects to it. How do we unlock Katana? Thank you, Anthony, for being a member for 29 months. You're breathtaking. Zelda, you have so, to stop jumping on everybody. Well, if you guys keep being your awesome, amazing self, you keep being your amazing, awesome self. Anthony, you're breathtaking. Thank you so much for your kind words. Thank you, and thank you for being a member for 29 months. Thank you for your support of the channel, Anthony. You're amazing, Anthony. Thank you so much. It's because of people like you that the channel is still around. Are you guys ready for a super race? Luke, Anthony's been a member for 29 months. Thank you, Anthony, for being a member for 29 months. I... a member. I said member. Oh, I thought you said member. Then it says keep being your awesome self. Thank you, Anthony. You're very... I appreciate the encouragement, Anthony. Thank you. And thank you for the super chat, Isaiah. Superman Returns was better. I don't even know what Superman Returns is. I don't think I ever saw that. Yes, you did. It had Brandon Routh in it. We Superman had a son. We don't with remember Lois Lane. seeing that. He rescued her in Air Force One. Ugh. That's... Well, maybe I'll have to try watching that again. I don't remember that. We have it. Mm. Somewhere. Super Ray. Henry Cavill could have been the best Superman. I feel like a Snyder understood the characters of Superman. Didn't don't don't feel like Snyder understood the characters of Superman and Batman. In his movie, he says to Garrett and Blackwing says Snyder didn't understand the characters at all. He just took the source line and ran with it. The problem is Snyder liked the interpretation of Superman and Batman from Frank Miller, and Frank Miller is not. I, I think that BBS could have been better if they had a different iteration of Superman that they were using. Because a Frank Miller Batman would work great for sin, uh, for film. The problem is a Frank Miller Superman does not. So they should have used like um, uh, Dan Jurgen or uh, some of the other people from even the 80s version of Superman. Like the late 80s would have been perfect. Um, Zelda! Honey, Why do you keep staring at me when you do it? Honey, that's spilling on the ground. There's electricity. Up, up, and away! Zelda, I do not have any wet food. I'm trying to tell you in English. Obviously, you're not understanding. She doesn't understand English because she doesn't speak it! She speaks cat ease. That's why she meows. That's why, you know. All these people just need to make a cat translate. I mean, you really want to use... I do, because it'll be fun to communicate with them. I think she's 
she would be like, you jerk, you better feed me. I will hate you forever. I'm going to scratch no, your eyes out of your sleeve. We could explain to her like why we don't have money and, you know, could also she could let us know when she needs her box changed and all kinds of stuff so she doesn't make a mess. Great. And you could also know, like, if the cat wants to be picked up, she'll let you know. That way you don't get accidentally scratched when you misinterpret what oh. the cat is trying to say. Oh yeah, sorry, Leader Gator. I'll try to get on Discord and look at the look at the custom characters when I have a chance. I'm sorry about that. Aha! Do the best I can. All right, guys. There's one more swamp quest left, mm. which is over this way. Yeah. No, I, I'm sure I've seen that. Oh gosh, yeah. I'm sorry, my tooth kind of hurt. Uh, Alright, guys, ventriloquist! Evil Superman, not evil Superman. I rewatched Superman the movie and Superman 2 a couple weeks ago. Awesome, uh, Garrett. Best Superman movies, in my opinion. Black Wings, Superman 1 and 2, all the best Superman films, bar none. Interesting. Wow. I don't know what the best movie is. All right, guys, we're talking to Scarface now. Yeah, Christopher Reeve, yeah. Yep, R.I.P. Christopher Reeve, definitely Isaiah. Yep, I will try to... Oh, thank you, Later Gator, I appreciate that. Thank you so much. Thank you for making the characters look... Later Gator, um, I think he put some pictures of them on Discord and he made custom characters of us. He's been working really hard thank on Thank you. That. I don't really have access to Discord right now, though. Okay. I'll, I will have access to it. I have a, I have a Discord account. I can look One on second. it. Alright, I'm gonna talk to Scarface to my little friend. What do you mean, I'm a control freak? How did we end up in Alligator City? We're gonna be lunch meat, you lousy no good. Calm down, Mr. Scarface. Remember your blood pressure. The Street Demons Gang did a number on our operation. Specifically, that. Quiet, dummy. If I wanted your opinion, I'd pull your strings. So, you numbskulls gonna help me or what? Don't keep our guests in the dark, are you? Mr. Scarface needs repairs to his body parts. These are specialist parts. Only the finest will do. So please, say yes before he does something rash. All right, let's help out Scarface. Okay, blockhead. Oh my gosh, friend. we got to collect Don't a bunch of stuff for Scarface. This is a big one. Yourself in pieces. Uh Maybe How in the world are you supposed to do this? Scarface needs what? What do you mean I'm a control? How did we end up in Alligator City? We're gonna be lunch meat, you lousy no good. C calm down, Mr. Scarface. R remember your blood pressure. The Street Demons Gang did a number on our operation. Specifically, that. Quiet, dummy. If I wanted your opinion, I'd pull your strings. So, you numbskulls gonna help me or what? Don't keep our guests in the dark, are you? There's icons on the minimap? Mr. Scarface needs repairs to his body parts. These are specialist parts. Only the finest will do. So please, say yes before he does something rash.
Oh, they're over at Ace Chemicals? Huh. Okay, I didn't know that. Oh, okay. You're gonna feed them tuna? Hey guys, can you still see the stream? YouTube says I went from 104 people watching to 16. Are you guys experiencing any lag? Can you see the game at all? Can you see me? quite like this. YouTube just got rid of every single one of our viewers that was watching. It went from 104 all the way down to 16. I don't know. It doesn't say 88 people are watching for me. It says 13. Yeah, you guys aren't experiencing any technical issues like we're being DDoS, but yet our viewership just plummeted. Now it's saying zero people are watching. Wow, that's crazy. So, I can just tell you real quick, we were actually on our way to getting close to a thousand views, and our, uh, uh, our viewership, concurrent viewers just plummeted to zero. This is so bizarre. But, I mean, you guys can see the stream fine. Well, I'm gonna do the quest anyway. So the scarf... Bleh, excuse me, words. The scarf... Scarface quest involves going to Ace Chemicals and getting these little thingies out here. So. We're gonna be zoomed for a while. Although I might switch to a flyer because flyers make it very easy to do side quests. Super easy. I mean, I literally have four people, like, YouTube says four people are watching, but people say in reality there's 80 people, but they're only counting four people. That's so bizarre. Uh-oh, I'm stuck! Oh, never mind. Uh, we're gonna put Zoom away. We were talking about Henry Cavill, let's bring him back. Uh, Henry Cavill is a Lego. I wonder if he knows he's a Lego. I wonder if Cavill knows he's a Lego. Maybe he does. He's a big gamer, so I'd be curious to know if he even plays... If he ever played the Lego games. Lego Batman or Lego DC games ever. That's a terrible smell, whatever that is. I've never smelled anything in my life like that. It smells like... Um, sulfur... Or actually, that smells like a gasoline or an electric fire. Amber, are the lights in the basement off? Okay. Yeah, that's not a good smell. That smells like an electrical fire or something. Yeah, no, I have zero people watching. Like, it's it's gone. But the stream is fine. You guys can see it fine. What do you expect from YouTube? I know right. 
Oh no, this never happens to any other streamer. Like, if this happened to more people on YouTube, they would make mention of it. Um, I'll take a picture of this. Wait, where is my phone? I don't have my phone, I can't take a picture of it. Oh, it's more YouTube shenanigans. In fact, I can tell you now, like, at one point we had 140 people, um, come onto the live stream. And they tried to DDoS us at, like, uh, oh, I think it was around, uh, 8 o'clock. You, you guys saw when, um, there was, like, 140 people, like, piled in here. Um, they tried to DDoS the stream. So that means we have about 40 haters. And they weren't successful because we have new methods installed by the authorities. Um... But they tried, and then when they couldn't, uh, they left. But what's funny is when they tried to do that, then their uh, IP address was probably tagged. And that security company actually did give me a call, so they're probably doing something. The only problem is, like, this new internet technology is, you know, really hard for us to use. Like, I still don't know how to use it. It's very confusing. Because it doesn't use our internet. Well, it does and it doesn't. But it's not like, oh, you know, if our internet goes down, we can't call the um, ISP provider because they've provided the signal and then someone else, you have to go through another company to get your internet working now. So it's very confusing. So I'm basically like paying for two different services. I'm paying the ISP the service provider to use the internet and then I'm paying another co uh, company to basically monitor our connection or something. It's, it's very, very confusing and, you know, very expensive. Right, hopefully these people will get arrested so I don't have to keep using this company because, you know, I think the company is very good, but also, again, very expensive. Entering this area will cancel your current mission. No! I don't want to go in there yet. So you're saying that the quest is not inside of there? So then where are these things that Scarface needs? It's saying I'm right here for the stuff that Scarface needs, but I see nothing. I think I struggled with this quest originally. Well, if it's not here then that means it's above me. So we need to take Henry above us. That'd be my only course of action. There we go. Okay, now we're cooking. Thank you, Sinestro. So yeah, basically when you, when you guys said, oh, um, there's 140 people here, like, now the stream's gonna do really well. No, they because, you know why I know those were hackers? Is because, like, they came in to see the stream real quick and to, you know, probably get the stream link to, to start doing their nasty stuff to it. And then they left immediately. Because usually what happens if, if we pop, uh, pop up in someone's feed and we have somebody come off the internet to watch us, they stick around for a while. Like, but haters come in real quick, they get the stream address, and then they bolt. That's how you know you're about to be DDoS when you have tons of people show up. But what they don't understand is Google actually takes note of when they do that. Like, um, they have, people don't realize this, but, you know, YouTube and Google, they know when you're watching the stream. They can tell. So, as we don't have the information, like, through our, our, um, our data, but YouTube does. So they can tell every user that popped into every stream. So the streams that got DDoSed in the past, we would tell YouTube what stream that was, and they're able to look at everyone who came into the stream. I know that's freaky, but um, it's true. <laughs> so they think they can hide, but they can't. And then that stuff gets sent over to the authorities. So, I mean, there's a lot of ways that you can actually use to track hackers these days that Google and YouTube even have. So every time somebody pops into a stream, their information is like in YouTube's system. 
it counts as like a viewer that popped in. So I, I thought that was kind of cool. I didn't even know they could do that. Thank you for the gifted membership, Isaiah. Appreciate it, buddy. All right, Henry. So we're looking for... Um, yeah, so, I mean, if people think they're anonymous, like when they come to a live stream, you're not. Your information is always being tracked by Google and YouTube. Every single time. Whether you're logged into YouTube or not, it's all tied to your IP address. Okay, so that's done. Now we need to go to the next part of Ace Chemicals. We need to pick up, it looks like, four bottles and some candy bars. Now, as long as you guys aren't doing anything bad, you don't need to worry about, like, Google or anything like that. But people that, you know, think that they pop into a live stream and they can't be tracked are fooling themselves. Because it's not true. So those uh, 40 people that popped in to do bad things, they're already being tracked. There's also a record of them coming, so... <clears throat> uh, I guess we're gonna go inside here, so I need to switch to Joker. Alright, first I need to switch to Clark Kent. Let's put a few smiles on some Let's face. put a smile on that face. He just said a Heath Ledger line. Leave this to me. Ta-da! Oh, that was a gold brick. I mean, that was useful, but that's not what I wanted to do. So then where is this stuff hiding at? This place. Oh, that's what's his name. We don't want to do this. But this is important where he is, but we're not doing that just yet. That's, that's not part of the quest that we're trying to do. But that is important. That is another character. Um, so past this guy, inside here, and across the way is the next thing that we need. So let's bring Sinestro. Do we already have Sinestro? Can we have two Sinestros at the same time or no? Can Wonder Woman fly? No. This version of Wonder Woman can't fly. So did you notice that the um, uh, Henry Cavill, Ben Affleck, and Gal Gadot versions of Batman and Superman and Wonder Woman don't talk? Like, they, they only grunt. They don't talk at all. Alright, so then where is this stuff? If it's located here and it's on the next building, where where exactly is the stuff that I need to go to? It's saying it's over here. Hey, isn't that one of Scarface's guys? Come on, boys, let's take it. Oh, the bad guys have the uh, bottles. So when you defeat the bad guys, you get the bottles from them? Watch it! You can't hit me! I'm a made man! I just hit you. So what now? What did you think was going to happen? Oh, sorry, Sinestro. I didn't mean to do that. Uh, yeah, what is that smell outside? Every YouTuber is having streaming issues right now? Interesting. Oh, I know, I know that, but I'm talking about, like, where you guys were, like, 140 people popped in briefly. It's like, those were hackers. Because, you know, most people, when they come to a stream, they stick around. Even if they just randomly find it, they're like, oh, okay, this is interesting. And also, we weren't talking about anything weird, so I wouldn't see why, you know, people would abandon the stream real quick. There was a reason why they popped in. This um, low view count has nothing to do with anything. Alright, so next up we have one more destination to go to, which is over here. You can see over here. Uh, is there a way for me to highlight it so I can kind of get my bearings a little bit? Okay, so we're going to go toward this gold brick. We're only doing the Scarfest. I can't talk anymore. 
We're only doing the Scarface quest. Hello. Um, and then we're gonna get ready for Star Wars. Star Wars is starting up. Um, I worked really hard on your YouTube short today, guys. It's the... I don't know what's gonna happen, if it's gonna get a copyright strike or what. I don't think it will, because I've seen people use music and shorts. And it's not like we make any revenue for shorts anyway, but I made an AMV with uh, Mary Jane... Or rather, Mary, Mary Sue Jane. Unstoppable. Um, and then I add a twist to it at the end. But all that stuff that we did in the Mary Jane stream, where like literally I was like bodying everybody that Mary Jane came across with her stun gun, I made a short of that. It was really funny. Um, so I hope you guys like it. And that'll be going up at 11.30 tonight. And then tomorrow we have some Final Fantasy shorts for you guys, and more um, shorts of uh, LEGO DC... Uh, yeah, LEGO DC Super Villains. Because we have a lot of LEGO DC Super Villains stuff yet. What is this? Oh no. This just happens to be a gold brick, doesn't it? What do you mean, wrong? You know what, I don't care, we're not doing that right now. You, you can go away. Oh! Red, green, red. I didn't see any of the color slash. Red, green, red. There's another color pattern. Red, Green, red, blue. Okay, so red, green, red, blue. Next one is going to be red, green, red, blue, something. Red, green, red, blue, yellow. Bingo. Okay. Piece of cake. Red, green, red, blue, yellow. Did I mention mewing? What? Did I say meowing? Did I mess up my words again? I might have. Okay. Okay. But I wasn't talking about that though, honey. I was talking about something else. Alright, so uh, we need to find this next thing for... It's either... It's probably on this building, right adjacent to us. Okay, wise guy. Tell us where Scarface All right, this is it. This is the Scarface stuff. You, on ice. you dare mess with Henry Cavill Superman? You dare, sir! You've got another thing coming. What do you mean, punny? Do I look punny to you? Wait, YouTube just crashed? Every channel they subscribe to has disappeared? Whoa! Sounds like they're doing a massive purge of subscribers. Holy crowd. Wow. All right, we're missing one plaque of wood. I need one more piece of wood and then we can finish the side quest. Well, I'm still going to stream. I'm going to try to stream uh um There it is. That's the last piece of wood I need. Scarface quest is done. 
やったーダーンダーンダーンダーンダーンダーンダーンダーンダーンダーンダーンダーンダーンダーンダーンダーンダーンダーンダーンダーンダーンダーンダーンダーンダーンダーンダーンダーンダーンダーンダーンダーンダーンダーンダーンダーンダーンダーンダーンダーンダーンダーンダーンダーンダーンダーンダーンダーンダーンダーンダーンダーンダーンダーンダーンダーンダーンダーンダーンダーンダーンダーンダーンダーンダーンダーンダーンダーン I don't even know what happened to it. I'm gonna try to upload the short. One sec, guys. Oh, Abdallah's streaming too? Mm -hmm. Is he doing Monster Hunter? Yeah, he's gotten in obsessed with Monster Hunter lately. He was telling me that. I was like, you're kind of late to the game, man. He's like, I'm really enjoying Monster Hunter. I mean, we're in a dry spell. There's nothing else to do, yeah. Hang on, guys. I'm making sure I can upload my short. Because while my short is done, I don't have it uploaded. That could be a huge problem. <clears throat> yeah, I, I don't see how you're going to get likes on the Star Wars stream. We'll just have to watch it. The good news is this, um, the stream of, uh, LEGO DC Supervillains is almost at 900 views already, so they're definitely getting another leggy. Bleh! I can't speak! They're definitely getting another LEGO DC Superhero stream. Tomorrow. Uh, Ace Attorney is still in trouble, though. Ace Attorney is at, uh... Where is Ace Attorney? Where's Ace Attorney? Oh. Ace is at 8.50. So Ace is close. Huh? I don't know, honey. But it's cool that that stuff held. Because that was usually when you had that many people pile into the stream. Um, it, can't, it can't hold it. Whoops. <laughs> Woohoo! Yeah, this came out pretty good. Mary Jane just bodying everybody. Oh wow, this did come out well. I did this really well. I got it, I got it to fit the ratio and everything. Yeah, Mary Jane just destroying everybody with her stun gun to the unstoppable song. Until Craven gets her gun. <laughs> yes, it all works! Okay. Alright, uh, unstoppable. Okay. Now, I don't know what's gonna happen when I try to upload this, though. So. Um, alright, where is, uh, Scarface at? Okay, why does that always pop up like that? That's super annoying. I don't like that. Hello, Scarface. This should fix you up r real good, Mr. Scarface. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You're breaking my heart. Just hand over the goods. Perfect. I'm gonna be like a new man. We're gonna own this two-bit town, one dummy at a time. 235? Scarface. <laughs> <laughs> 
I mean, it might go back to normal. He only has about 50 people watching his, like, streams so lately. And he doesn't seem to be bothered by it very much. Alright, so, anyway guys, uh, I'm gonna try to upload the short, and then I will see you guys for Star Wars. So, in order to get another stream of, um, LEGO DC Supervillains, you guys literally just need to get a thousand views. The stream's at 900, so it's just a hundred views. That's it. Um, Ace Attorney needs, uh, needs a hundred and, uh, Ace Attorney needs... About 150, something like that. And we're good to go. So, today in uh, LEGO DC Super Villains, we um, got Sinestro back. We did a ton of um, uh, side quests here in, you can see. Actually, I think we did all the side quests. I think everything here is done in the swamp for now. Unless they add more stuff in the story later, I'm not sure. But I think everything here in, in the swamp area is done. That leaves Gotham... All of Metropolis we haven't tackled at all yet. Um, we have a little bit of Ace Chemicals left to do before Red Hood's unlocked. We still have more stuff here. We have all of Amusement Mile. All of this out here, Arkham. A lot of stuff in Arkham. Um, everything in Metropolis, everything in uh, Smallville. So, I mean, there's still, still quite a bit to do. But um, thank you guys for watching, and I hope you had fun. And tomorrow will be uh, more of the story, as well as more of uh, free roaming and stuff like that. And uh, next up is Star Wars. You guys will be redirected. I don't know if you'll be redirected through the redirect system. I think the redirect system is not working properly. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put a link in the description. I'm not in the description. I'm going to put a link in the chat. Let me know if you see the link now. So I'm putting the link in now. Boom. Link is in. Do you guys see the link? Yeah, the likes aren't going up on the other streams, so don't worry about the 40 likes to start because it's not happening um, for the Star Wars. But we're still going to have fun with Star Wars. Star Wars will be starting up at 10.15. Um, we're a little late, but uh, I'm also trying to upload the short. It's not letting me upload the short. This is very concerning because um, I really need to upload the short, actually. I'm not worried about the copyright. I'm, I'm worried about saying you aren't eligible to upload shorts. It's like, what? She gets shot with an arrow and she just pulls it out like it's nothing. Oh uh, my gosh. <laughs> that face! That face that Mary Jane has! That's perfect! She's unstoppable. Okay. Shorts. Hopefully, I mean, before I tried to upload it, it said I wasn't eligible, so I'm going to try. Uh, schedule it for 11.30. And then we're good to go. This is our ending screen anyway, so I mean, I can't go back to the main screen because it has problems. Um, okay, so um, yeah, thank you for watching, guys. You'll be redirected over to Star Wars, and uh, I'll see you in about, uh, you know, less than 15 minutes. God bless, happy gaming. Thanks so much for watching. Lego Star Wars. Or, Lego DC Super Villains should resume tomorrow. You guys have 925 views at this point. So great job, everybody. Head on over to Star Wars. See you over there.